I'm guessing that when the other one's hooked up, it's gonna push the other one's bottom in so they'll stay closed. Like go ahead and plug it in. You'll see how the bottom kicks out a little bit. Yeah, that should be good. I can do that and I put a cable to this bottom to where it holds it like this. So it won't go no further than that. And then I have it to where it doesn't go all the way past the two by four so it won't get this part stuck on it or anything like that. What this is, is just a sliding doorway. It's a barn door crack. There's a little little clevis there. It sounds nice and loud because of that tin on there. The way it's set up, this is a four-way valve for regulated uh, 10 PSI of air. When the power's off, the door's open. What we're gonna do is just use basically a switch open up the door. If there's something goes wrong, they just hit the kill switch, doors will come open, lights will come on. Air comes into here. These are adjustable mufflers, so you can actually increase the speed if you dare. This is only 10 PSI too. Go ahead. Go ahead, plug it in. That's how this breaks. You know what Pretty I mean? Pretty quick, yeah. especially around here. And what I always do, I take these, I adjust them all the way in. Okay, unplug it. You just find out which one's your exhaust. This one ain't it. This one is. So you just adjust it just a tiny little bit. Go ahead and open it. I'm hitting it and it's not doing nothing. We just just it a tiny little bit, like I'm barely moving it. Put your finger on there, push in, and tighten that bottom nut. All right, let go. All right, open it. Close it. All right, go ahead. 